Alright, time to go to the moon. Yay, we're gonna ride with him. It's gonna be spectacular. Please, wait here. Someone will come and show you around shortly. There's his backpack again. Jeez, he really likes his backpack. How pathetic. All this trouble just for some girl. That's what I thought you'd say, Neil. How pathetic. All this trouble just for some girl. There you go. Good to have you back. Yeah, yeah. What about the book? I can see the book. The story about a lame duck's attempt to become an astronaut. A novel by Joey Wiles. I can't believe this crap actually sold. This isn't the real world, Neil. Let's see, can I go in the door? This top secret door? Ooh. What about this door? Nope. Before, of course it is. There's an elevator. Beep boop. Erm. Um, is it me or is this elevator smaller on the inside? I think I was just on the first floor, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah there we go. Yeah. This looks exactly the same. I didn't know he may have went to the second floor for this. So do you think last century's moon landing was... Let's not, Neil. Let's not. Alright. This is the Mission Control Center. There's not much going on now, but you'll see it live one day. I half expected to see Zordon on that screen. It's not here. Uh, what? Let's just go. What, the platypus? See what's in this door. Wait, no, this door. Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. Bah. I hope the real NASA has bigger elevators. And here's the centrifuge. If you're lucky, you'll learn to hate it one day. Ah, yes, the spinny thingy. It's not here either. What are you talking about? Come on, we don't have long left. What's up here? Your records are excellent, but we'll have to monitor your sass closely in the coming sessions. Oh, go on, they're waiting for you. Blah, blah, blah. Gonna give it a nice little save. Oh no! It's in red. That's not good. Let's see what's on the fourth floor. Come here, you. The shuttle's still under heavy maintenance. We may only view it from here for now. Ah, this isn't good. Perhaps there's somewhere we missed. Er, you need to work on your communica communication skills. Whoa! Yeah. You know what's the best part of it? What? The very top and bottom of the shuttle. I'd have to agree. Oh, how I pity anyone who can't see those particular parts. Indeed. Especially its nose at the top. <laughs> when maintenance finishes, it probably won't look the same. Yeah, that was the only time. Yeah, they're, they're, they're talking about us. We don't get to see that. Oh, subtle fourth wall breaking humor. Good job. How was that walking in the door? Seriously. So, she's looking for the platypus, I think. So that means rivers. She might have done it right. I wonder if the real NASA looks like this. Probably not. It's constructed in part of Johnny's belief, after all. Ah, yes, a wiki of it. existing facts tainted by personal fairy tales. It 
It's odd though, to hear birds and see none. Sorry, Neil. I really thought there was a good chance. What? This is the break room. Here's David. He's a mission specialist. Nice to meet you. At least he got into NASA, I guess. You think he made it to the end? Even if he did, it would take more than just a few years to become an astronaut. Let's hurry and find the last link, then. I'd hate to miss the finale. Oh no. What's going on? Are we out of time? I... I don't know. Ah, and here's our other new recruit. River, right? Good to have you on board. Hello, I'm John. Phew. I almost thought she wasn't... What the... <laughs> Eva? But you deleted her. No, I told you, I just moved her. What she does with her life here is still up to her. But this new world, it's based on public data and Johnny's own beliefs. And since River's data as an individual is not recorded in the public domain, it all comes from Johnny. But even then, that merely increases the odds. How are you sure that it'd work? I wasn't. It could have gone very badly, you know. You were never one to take risks, Neil. Let's just say I won this round. We still have the, have the two spare helmets, right? I think Johnny'd appreciate some company. Aww. Good job, Rosaline. I'm sorry I ever doubted you. Sudden music change. Back to his piano. Let's see if he gave it a new name. He wrote it himself, apparently. Rather repetitive, if you, if you ask me, though. What's it called? To the moon. Alright. I think that was what it's called. I like that name. The centrifuge. the other two linked in. Lily and the Doctor. Oh, there you are. You two should go get some rest. Tomorrow's the big day. Yay! We get to go into space. To see the moon launch. Or witness it. Controlling indeed. I want to be an astronaut too, Dad. One day, son. Just might. Meh. Ah. Keep clicking on the side, the edges of the squares. Oh, Nicholas. You should have seen him back when we went to school together. I swear, the guy never rested. 
He just kept on trying and trying. It was like he only had one goal to work for. Isabel! Did you think that they would make it? Ha! Huh, did you? No. The way she is, I didn't think she would succeed. But I, I guess I was wrong. All the better then, isn't it? Yes, I'm happy for them. You know, that's my brother in that shuttle. Wow! Yep, I once wrote a book about this too. With a less optimistic ending. Heh. <laughs> Might have to change that after all. Hey, Dr. Watts, right? Thank you for letting us in here. Yeah, yeah. Eva's the one who requested it. Did you found, find out why he wanted to go to the moon? Sure. And? What all happened here? Let's just say it was bu a bunch of sappy cheese that sorted itself out. You know, there were quite a few times last night when I thought we lost Johnny. I think he consciously held on to wait for you two. He's rather patient, then. I just hope it was worth the wait. Go on now, your colleague's waiting. Oh wait, now I can see the top and the bottom. They lied to me. I thought this might be a good view. Good enough to cut off the track again. Sure, even if it were if they were real. Well, this is it. All we've worked for. Ready to initiate it? Yes. Let's do it. Come up here. Uh, why? Why not? You're just gonna push me off the ledge again, aren't you? Probably. But the view is worth the odds. Come on. If you say so, Miss Miss Lady Pants. T minus ten. That's it. You don't get it anymore. So lovely. Uh-oh. Oh no! Johnny! Hang in there, old chap! Ship. Because one day, I'm going to befriend one of them. Look at it go! Ah, oh, just look at that nose and the thrusters I can exactly see through all the fire. Abandoned ship! There's a monkey on the wing! Was it a monkey or was it like a gremlin or something? I don't know. That was an airplane anyways, nobody cares. You made it, Johnny. You made it. <laughs> he tried to push her. Or vice versa. One of the two. And then it still happened, just with Joey, among them all. Well, not actually, but to Johnny it did happen. And there's- oh! And because NASA has great he healthcare benefits, she's still here. Or she was still there and when he passed, at the very least. Oh 
no, Johnny. It's destabilizing. You were a good man, Johnny. We will never forget. Written and directed by Ken Reeves Gow. Developed by Ken Reeves Gow. Lonnie Neely the Third. That was a good game. That was a that was a really good game. It's very touching. Gets me right here. That was my heart, by the way. Yay, memories! We get to watch them all over again. As time passes. I think this episode has... This part has run on pretty long, too. I was kind of at the climax, so... Forgive me for that. Oh, it looks like it's gone pretty fast. Just gotta show the credits. Rabbit didn't have a blue or a yellow stomach and blue ears and feet. So the blue ears and the blue feet were th the sky, and the yellow stomach was the moon. That's so why she kept trying to make him ask if he remembered, which he didn't because of what happened with his brother. Thanks to the beta blockers, because I had to had to let you know that. That's important. A Freebird Games production. Yay! Congratulations, everybody. GG, GG. And there's the lighthouse. Once again. With two gravestones. Wait. Oh, never mind. Here he is! Thanks. Off you go now. I still can't believe Johnny just willed the house to Lily like that. Heh. <laughs> Who else was there to give it to? Us? Terrible place for burials, though. If there's a landslide, they'd be swimming with the fishes. Still a little too soon. No, it's never soon enough. Nice new ringtone. Hello, Eva here. We're on our way. New patient? New patient. Let's roll. Our work is never done. <gasps> I knew it. This is him reliving his me memories. He just took some the pain pills or painkillers. Ooh, you clever guy. Press escape to exit.